Does he know that you're his mom? No, I don't think he does. He knows I'm a caregiver, um, and he knows I'm one of this team of caregivers that I think are important and special to him. But the concept of, or this idea that I'm his mother isn't there, I don't think. All right, shall we come over? Come over and say hello? I, I would say that I was traumatized by the lawsuit. It really is and feels like standing up to Goliath as David in the, the classic biblical story. To them, it was business. To them, it, was in, it wasn't personal. Um, and in fact, the opposing counsel came over and said that to me. And I've spent a lot of time thinking about that statement because for me, of course, it was personal. This was my life, this was my child. During a lawsuit, nothing is sacred, so my parenting, my, my childbirth experience, my body were open to critique and any kind of conversation. I can actually accept the fact that a physician made an egregious, avoidable mistake because physicians are human. I think where my anger is directed is, this, is directed to this, this system, this process that we were essentially gambling things like our house and our life savings that had we lost, um, we would have had to access that money to pay legal fees. You're put through this long and very torturous um, experience that, that is both traumatic and, and really victimizes people who I think are already victims.